Hello, welcome to Dragon Age Origins. Uh, last, last time we left off getting ready to do Caravan Down. But first, I just, I gotta know, are you excited? Because I'm freaking excited. <laughs> they finally have announced Dragon Age Dreadwolf coming out. I'm still gonna call it Dreadwolf. I know it's Veilguard now, but Dreadwolf just sounds way cooler. But I'm so, so happy. And they still haven't set the date yet. I'm hoping they get the date soon, but... You guys, it's finally coming out! Yes! And I know there's a lot of hate for it, for the graphics, because the graphics are... The style choice is a little... Uh, a little too League of Legends, a little too... I guess Gen Z? I don't know. Not, not sure how I feel about that. But I'm I'm more concerned about the story and how much they're gonna butcher it. I just think that whatever the OG writers wanted to do, that's what they should have stuck with. And if they changed any of that, then they're doing it wrong. Because Origins was great, so and Inquisition. I don't know. For me, the only the lore was still really interesting. But I think the only thing that really stood out was Solus. And did, didn't they get rid of Sol the person who wrote Solus? Wasn't it Patrick Weeks? Didn't they get rid of him? I don't know. That's the part that I'm most nervous about is how... How much of it that did they change from what the original writers actually wanted? Or at least the writers from Inquisition. But I'm just... I'm glad that it's finally, finally coming out because I miss the egghead. <laughs> I gotta know what happens. And I'm gonna be really upset if they don't give like some kind of a satisfactory ending for the Solovalen people. Because we, we need something that... <clears throat> even if it's bittersweet, we need something. Oh no! Everyone's dead. Who are you marking for death? Darkspawn. Merchants of the Border Caravan were already dead. Go to the Chantry board. Alright. Alright, because I waited too long. Oops. Anyways, I also want to... Ah, oh, damn it. So, I have a theory that if you've played all the games, you know that every game so far, one of the mages has betrayed us. And I don't think it would be in true Dragon Age fashion if they didn't do that again. But I think most people are going to assume that it'll, it will be Emmerich. I think that's his name. Because he's a necromancer, so he's all dark and mysterious, which must mean that he's evil, right? But I think, actually, that it's going to be Balara. Because she's an elf. And because she is a veil jumper so she's like interested in the ancient elven artifacts and everything to do with the ancient elves so i think it makes a lot of sense that she's probably gonna side with solace and betray rook and the veil guard i'm probably not the only person who thinks this but <laughs> i just have to throw that out there now so that way i can say that i called it or maybe they're gonna think that everybody's gonna assume that's Valara, and then it'll end up being Emmerich. It's gonna be wrong though if they if someone doesn't betray us. There's, it's gotta be. All men are the work One of the of mages has to do it. Hat. That's just it's tradition and at this point. Much sweat, Let's see what will we do next. I still have not shuffled the deck. This was this is all from the last couple videos. This is what we still have to go through. So the next card is the next number. 
two of swords. One. Didn't I try to do that one already? Yeah, we said, sorry, I don't have time for that. <laughs> okay, so uh, no to that one, and we'll try this. Mage's treasure. The others are buried several to venture generals out in the forest. Bread sinners. Oh, oh, would you stop correcting me? I know the chant like the back of my hand. Probably should just Google where I need to go instead of wasting my time doing this. I think they're over here, at least one of them is. This is This is a tombstone of a Tevinter general. The epitaph makes it clear his spirit was left to guard over something. Why is this one again? The stir of the tombstone. Here. Oh, cover two of them. Two more remain. And I'm off. Disturb the peace. Interesting. So the Juggernaut stuff is better than the Legion stuff. I got the 
juggernaut armor is um, at Soldier's Peak right now. So that kind of sucks. Oh, there's the juggernaut. Just blind. strength isn't high enough. I think the Legion stuff will look better on him since he's a dwarf. Very nice. Frail little old Gertrude in her big ass armor set. Okay, what quest is next? Princess of Cups. Princess is 11. So, turn 11. Ooh. Can I do that one yet? I think I need to be able to get into um, the Dalish area in Denerim. And I'm not there yet. Yeah, I need to get to unrest in the alien edge. Not there yet. Where am I at with the overall story? <laughs> I don't even know. The last request. Can't do that one yet. I don't think. Oh wait, maybe I can. Remember, I, I think I tried to do this one. But couldn't because it was just everyone there was way too strong. I still need to heal Arl Eamon and then I can do the lands meet. That'll be interesting. Let's see if I can do the last request. I've leveled up a lot since the last time I tried to do that one, so I think I'll probably be okay this time. Ooh, another um, theory that I have for the next game. Those two figures that come out, that are like broken free from the veil at the end of that trailer, my guess is that it's Elgernon and Andruil. That was initially what I assumed, and um, <clears throat> after watching Jackdaw's video that I think he did like six months ago, He had basically the reasons why he thought it was those two, or same, pretty much the same reasons why I thought, although his was a lot more detailed, but I just kind of was like, I think it's those two. That was what my gut was telling me what was going on. Well, I'm excited. That is a most offensive odor. And you're looking at me? Should I be looking elsewhere? Have you forgotten about the fish you stored in your backpack, perhaps? I was saving it. Won't be ready for the lie for at least another day. Even the chastened did not have such disgusting habits, and they consumed the flesh of the dead. Fine, fine. I'll soak it in the lie now. Have it your way, Miss Squeamish. That's not what I... Uh, no, never mind. Just get it over with, quickly. Disgusting. Chastened would eat flesh, cannibals. But... Huh. Nasty. Can we just go to Denerim without any anything? Okay. Yeah, this looks familiar. Huh. Watch out! Trap there. Trap where? On it. Here I am. Really? Slay <laughs> them all. Blood mage. Can't go after that. You. Put everyone to sleep. Why did I get that? 
easier. Is this the one where they try and convince us to help them? No, I don't think so. But I don't know. I thought I told you to attack them. But everyone to see. I think this is going much better going. than the last time. But also that one creature does sort of look like this, except it looks more like... I think it looks more tentacle-y, like a sea creature. Less like a dragon. And I think there's more Watch traps. out! Trap there! Yep. before. job. All that work for nothing. Almost there. I know not how you have survived thus far. Is it luck or providence? No matter. You will not survive this! Huh! Let's wipe the melt. Okay. Oh. 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 Oh.
See which next quest we're gonna do. Seven of Pentacles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Find five scrolls of banister and return them to the mages collective. It's not very interesting. Do I have any of those? Oh, okay. I'm missing one. And now it's all black. That's, that's a good sign. Let's try the ruins. I feel like that'd be the most likely place. I saved. God damn it. Did I save? I don't think so. Damn it. Don't want to do that fight again. No. 